A renovation project in downtown Cameron uncovered a piece of history. KRHD's new reporter Rebecca Fiedler introduces us to the business owner and the surprise she found. Take a look. A work crew was removing old plaster from the facade of an historic building in downtown Cameron earlier this week. What they found underneath was something to behold. I've, I've just done some preliminary Google searches, but you know, we could look into restoration of the mural. But it does depend actually on the structural integrity of the bricks themselves, because they're probably 100 years old. A classic Coca-Cola mural and other vintage logos line the red brick walls of the Milam County AgriLife building, a building that's been a furniture shop, a shoe store, and many other businesses over the past hundred years. Aaron Bradley's efforts to bring life and community back to downtown Cameron with a nail salon coffee bar combo are just like those of many new business owners planning to move into the city here in the next few months. We, we want the boutique businesses in downtown Cameron. We want it in the county. You know, we want it to be a, 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 a site where you go. We want it to be an attractive thing. We want people to have pride in downtown Cameron. Milam County government offices like AgriLife are vacating all the historic buildings, moving into a newly constructed government building that will be ready in April. Locals like Bradley are eager for the shops and restaurants that will come in their place, bringing life back to downtown while preserving history. I'm just excited for the opportunity to create another meeting space for the town and make sure that people have a place that they can come together. Bradley says she and her family aren't sure what they're going to do with the mural. They do hope to find the original artist who made the mural and pay some sort of homage to the history of the building. Reporting in Cameron, Rebecca Fiedler, KRHD News.